Valley Springfield News at 11. The UMass football team is about to play Michigan. It's their first time playing at the Big House. Sports director Ezra Broder is with the team in Michigan. The stands behind me are empty right now, but come tomorrow, over 110,000 people will pack into Michigan Stadium. Now, to put that into perspective, 75% of the population of Springfield could fit into Michigan Stadium, and that's a fact that's not lost on the players. Take a listen to what they had to say when they first walked into the stadium. It's uh, pretty big. Pretty big. <laughs> well, expectations were high, but definitely not under my expectations. This is a real nice stadium, nice field, feels nice. I just uh, can't wait to play. It's amazing being on this field though, uh, honestly. And to see it on TV, you always want to come. And now that you're actually here, it's like a dream come true. Like I've been saying though, the field's 100 yards, just like it is everywhere else, you know. Um, I actually thought it was going to be bigger, to be completely honest. I don't know why, but I expected to be like in the Coliseum in Rome or something, like <laughs> massive walls everywhere. But I mean, it's, it's really exciting. Well, yeah, I mean, the field definitely looks boxed in with the way the stadium is with the brick walls on the outside. So, you know, it's still the same deal. I mean, we're uh, the hype, I think, will be more when the actual crowd's in the stands and, and it's game time. You know, right now, I'd say it's, it's a Friday practice and uh, we'll have some fun. We'll let the kids bounce around the turf a little bit. As for the game itself, UMass has to be on top of its game. Michigan is a top 25 team in the country. Be sure to watch us tomorrow night at 11 o'clock for a complete recap of the game, including exclusive interviews and behind the scenes footage from here in Michigan. In Ann Arbor, Michigan, Ezra Broder, CBS3 Springfield.